really looking forward to coming out and competing at a high level this year. Uh, we, we've got six seniors and put a lot of time and effort into the summer, uh, much improved from last year. Uh, you know, we're coming off of, of a season that we had a lot of injuries and, and, you know, this year guys are in great shape and, you know, we've had a great preseason of guys coming together, putting in a lot of work and uh, we're really looking forward to the start of our season. You know, Dante Jordan's coming off of a off of a tough year last year. He had the shoulder injury, and you know, in this summer he's really worked hard to rehab the shoulder and, and get back to full strength. Um, you know, we're looking for him to do a lot of things for our team this year. He's, you know, he needs to come out, rebound, play defense. He needs to score the ball from the post, from the perimeter, and uh, you know, we're asking for for a lot from from him. Uh, Lorenzo Christmas uh, led our team in scoring last year. You know, we're looking for him to come out and, and just be more of a consistent scorer, someone we can rely on night in and night out uh, to make plays from the perimeter. And also, you know, defensively, he's got to pick it up as, as a senior. Uh, Wes Lyons is a guy that had got a lot of experience as a redshirt freshman last year. Um, we're looking for him to, 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 to be the same as far as, um, you know, being able to score inside, being able to hit shots from the perimeter, and being able to handle the ball uh, for his position. Uh, Charles Hagler, uh, a point guard last year, got a lot of experience. Um, he's much improved, had a really good summer. He, um, you know, started to develop it, uh, his outside shot along with being able to really get to the basket uh, and he's picking it up on the defensive end as well. Mustafa Nimbisi is, is a player uh, that we're looking uh, forward to, to having him be have a breakout year. He. Uh, he, he really got a lot of experience last year uh, as a post player for us and this year, this summer, he's really worked hard in the weight room, put on a lot of extra uh, muscle and, and, and really worked on his post moves and, and uh, he's going to be much improved for us uh, moving forward. You know, we feel like, you know, defensively, rebounding, um, sharing the basketball, those are three keys we feel like we need to uh, do well on a nightly basis. If we come out every night and we really get after it on the defensive end, if we're going to the glass, we're winning the rebounding battle every night. And uh, you know, then the last thing is sharing the basketball. We feel like we have a team this year that we can we can spread it around a little bit. We don't need to rely on one or two guys uh, to to lead us in scoring every night. We feel like we have a strong bench. Guys can come in off the bench and make plays and and help us in that area and if we can put those three phases of the game, defense, rebounding, uh, taking good shots, uh, we have a chance to, to, to be successful. You know, this year with the six seniors, our, you know, our seniors have big, big expectations for this year. I mean, we want to compete, we want to we want to get into the playoffs, we want to compete for a home court um, for the playoffs this year, fight for the Eastern Conference Championship, fight for a PSAC Championship, get into the NCAA Tournament. I mean, these are all things that our seniors have talked about uh, ever since you know the end of the last season and, and they you know put in a lot of work every single day to to prepare us um, for what's coming and we know that this season like 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 all of them the PSAC is uh, is a great league with a lot of good teams a lot of good coaches a lot of good players and we got to be able to, uh, to to come ready every night and, and for our seniors this is their last opportunity and they're looking for big things.